And now to Disability Pride Month, and one movie theater is making an effort to be more inclusive with special movie nights. Yeah, they've uh, adjusted everything from the sound to the smells to help those with sensory processing challenges enjoy the movies. Our Will Reeve was there to check it out. He's back with that. Hello again, Will. Hello again, TJ. A lot of the magic of movies lies in the movie theater experience, but for some people with sensory issues, a night at the movies can be overwhelming. So Disney, along with some advocacy groups, has put together a program to make movies inclusive of and magical for everyone. A night out at the movies is a delight to the senses. But for many with sensory processing challenges, movie theaters can be overwhelming. Everybody with an invisible disability of some sort experiences sound and light and even senses like smell in different ways. Whatever causes a sensory overload for me might not cause a sensory overload for somebody else. Los Angeles' El Capitan Theater launched a program to host special sensory inclusive screenings of every new Disney movie. Sean Culkin is on the autism spectrum and helped design the experience. We have sounds turned down for a specific viewing so that it limits the risk of it and sensory overload occurring during the movie. And we have certain spaces that we can bring individuals to help them recollect themselves. Popcorn is an essential part of the movie theater experience, but for people with sensory issues, the smells and sounds of popping kernels can cause issues. So here at El Capitan, they pre-popped it for this special screening. Lizette Bartolome, whose son Jordan is on the autism spectrum, says social empathy makes a big difference for the whole family. Something like going to a movie theater, we don't really do that very often because there are times where we know he's probably going to have a meltdown. She took her family to the first sensory inclusive screening of Lightyear. Our first test flight is a go. He didn't watch the whole thing, but he was able to experience it. I was actually watching my son and just kind of the face and the joy in his face. Kate McSpadden is on the autism spectrum and saw Thor in the theater. Let me tell you the story of the space Viking, Thor Odinson. With the people you were sitting around, what did they have to say about their experience? Everyone seemed to really like it and they were able to enjoy the film without being overwhelmed. So this was an amazing experience. The reviews were resoundingly positive from everyone coming out of the theater. And the main takeaway was that this was not an other movie experience. It was perfect for everyone, and it was inclusive. So Disney plans to extend this program beyond Disability Month because it really is so special for everyone. Movies should be for everyone. And at El Cap that night, they were. Guys. All right, and that is wonderful to see. Well, thank you so much. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.